If you were to ask me which is the most fabulous character in English literature, I would nominate a tank engine. Thomas the Tank Engine. And that's enough of the Ichabod and Mr. Toad spoofing dialogue. For years, I've had the idea of making a Bachman adaptation of one of my favorite Thomas stories of all time, Duck and the Diesel Engine. I envisioned something that would be Adventure Begins-esque. It would start with a brief but entire history of Duck on the Island of Sodor. It would acknowledge that it was before many of the engines, giving the other engines an excuse to make a cameo. I had all sorts of epic ideas included in part of it. The adaptation would include the magazine stories that explain Diesel's insults, told in a way that would not contradict the original book. And of course, I would include the city of Truro's visit. But unfortunately, due to having a full-time job, certain Bachman items taking a long time to be finished, and because I'm also working on an adaptation of The Wind in the Willows in claymation form, I don't think this project is going to happen, but I have some other ideas instead. During my last semester of college, I began a remake of Pop Goes the Diesel, which I ended up never finishing. So I've decided I'm going to finally finish that, just with not as much quality as I originally intended. And also, I'm wishing to refilm my train spotting at Nap Food in the Morning video I made a few years ago. In addition, I'm hoping to remake this video. And lastly, since I'm not able to tell Duck and the Diesel Engine is as much detail as I want to, I'm thinking instead I'm going to abridge the story to, I'd say, about five minutes, done in a similar way that I'm adapting The Wind in the Willows. Hopefully in all this I'll be able to make use of the $20 worth of ballast that I bought last year from various hobby stores I visited. So that's about it. Hopefully I'll be able to get at least one of these projects done this year. So long for now. <laughs>